Hello, this is Harshit and in this tutorial video I'll show you how to upload a website on the cloud so that it's publicly available on the internet. To begin with, first go to a website called github.com. It is an online website for exactly storing code but you can also store it to publish your website. Now go to the sign up form and just create a login ID and credential. First of all, username, for example, I just Hit test underscore zero five six seven test five six seven eight nine CLU email addresses password and click on create an account click on unlimited private repositories for free click on next click on sub skip this step and your account is done once your account is created go back to the email id which you have used for the registration where you must have received an email from github saying please verify your account so just click on verify this email and it will just verify your email now go back to your website this github account and click on settings click on emails Mm, sorry, sorry, sorry. Just verify your account from the GitHub. Once you've verified it, you will show you the message your email has been verified. Now to publish your website online, click here, click on new repository. Like this is like a new server for uploading your website. Click on new repository. Enter the repository name as the name of the website you want to. Now, now first of all, click on new repository. Enter the name of your website. For example, my website dot and after that you have to enter this special word G I T H U B GitHub dot I O. Okay, in description you can write what your website is all about. So here I'll write testing website upload. Click on public, click on here and initialize with readme, click on create repository. Once this is done, you will get an interface like this. Now to publish your website, go to your my computer and go to the folder where you have created all your website. This is the place where I have created all my data and all my website. Now, the first page which of the website that should load up when your URL is opened, rename it as index.html. Click on rename and rename as index.html. Click save and all the other pages that link to that first page should also have a hyperlink of index.html. For example, my second page has a URL to the first page, so the page URL name should be index.html. Um, the name of the page should be index.html because I've changed the name of the first page. Index.html, click save and close it. Now to publish your website online, 
click on all the files that are part of your website drag them to this page and upload them once the upload has been started you have to enter what you have done in this upload so you will write uploaded my files for website click on commit changes now this will put your website on the cloud once these files are uploaded it will be visible here in this folder go to settings drag it down click on github pages click on this master branch button click on save again scroll down to github pages and here you will get a link saying your website is ready and published at this url Just open this url and here is my website loaded so now you can give this url to anyone in the world and you can access it online or through the internet but one more change for example if you want to do some changes in your website for example in the first web page i did some changes for example i changed my name in the website for example this is the this was the first page which was index.html remember the first page the website should load up should always be named as index.html for example here i wrote something this is a change in website i save it and then i close my notepad now if i again want to put these changes in the website in the cloud i'll just open github go to my uh, uh, i'll go to github again i'll just repeat the procedure i'll click on sign in enter my username that's my email id password click on here and you will find my repositories click on this we older url you have and again click select all the files that were locally on your drive drag it to the github and again upload them once all the files have been again uploaded click on every time you save a changes you have to write here change what changes you have made to the files so you like changes made you like you can write it here anything you want it's just like a, a register for making entries of whatever you do in the copy click on again commit changes and if you open the web page reload the web page from the web link you can see the changes have been reflected in the public website so this was a small tutorial on how to publish a website if you have any doubt just message me and that was all goodbye